Hi, and welcome back to Music with Mrs. Smith. We are working now in Essential Elements Book 1, if you are not from my class. And we are going to start today with a warm-up um, number 75. It's quite a ways back. But uh, let's go to 75 and remind ourselves of the concert A-flat. I'm going to play its basic blues. And we're going to do the repeat because it's just so short. Here we go. Ready. One, two, ready, go. short. Um, we are now at number 107, so if you turn in your books now to page 21, we have a new note. Um, always a fun time in class when there's a new note. So, glutes, you guys have a D flat, and that is only your pinky, so nothing else. That's sound like this. That's it. Clarinets, you have the E flat, so uh, you've got your back thumb, one and two, and then on your side button here, okay, so you got your thumb, one, two at the top, and your side button here is where you're going to press that bottom key. It's going to sound like this. Okay, and bass clarinet, same thing. Alto saxophone, you have a B flat, and it's a, kind of a low B flat. So you're going to be playing one and two, one, two at the top. And then your right hand is going to, on your side keys right here, you're going to press this one, two, three at the bottom one down. Okay, tenor saxophone. I'm just going to show you the fingering, but it's going to sound the same thing. It's going to sound like this. Okay, down there. And you have, um, oh, sorry, you are actually a little higher. Same sound. You're going to have your octave key at the back, one, two, three on the top, one, two, three on the bottom, and then you are going to do right here where your, these are your pinky flaps. You're going to press this top one here. Now, mine is a little bit uh, broken here. This key, so it's not pushing out for me. That's where the problem is. Aha, I found it. So, um, that is what you're going to press down there. Okay, hey. and trumpet, and brass, any brass with valves, you have valve two and three. It's gonna sound like this. So, trumpets and treble clef baritone, you have an E flat. Bass clef baritone, you have a D flat. Okay, tuba, you have a D flat. And trombone, you have a D flat. You are at position five. Dun. Baritones, this is where your note's going to be. Okay, the flat zone is number 107. Um, so let's play that note um, for four beats. Find your new fingering. One, two, ready, go. Okay, let's play four quarter notes. Ready? One, two, ready, go. Here we go. Okay. So let's try this one out. Here you go. One, two, ready. I'm oh, sorry, it's in four. One, two, ready, go. Mm -hmm. 
that flat zone even just the first bar first two bars are great for learning that note just try playing those a few times and that will really help you percussion I'm just not gonna worry about those ties I'm just gonna play it as written here you go one two ready go Look at on top of Old Smoky. So this piece is going to use our new note. Check your key signature. Um, our new note will be highlighted with the flat in front of it, so you'll always know when you're playing that. Okay, and double check your key signature for the other notes. Okay, when you're listening to me playing, and if something sounds not quite right, um, you might not be playing the right note. So if you look altos, you have no F sharps or C sharps. Clarinets, you only have B flat and trumpets. So make sure you're playing the correct uh, note. So trumpets, you're gonna be using first vowel for that B flat. Okay, so I'm gonna play now on top of Old Smokey. We, we have an upbeat, so I'm gonna give you one, two, three, one, two, and you come in on the second. One, two, three, one, two. maybe this one a wee bit faster um, so those long notes aren't quite so long. I know some of you are probably running out of breath. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, one, two. Notice there, I did run out of breath. Um, the uh, and around the around bar seven or eight. Okay, and lastly, uh, snare drum. Okay, so snare drum, you have like a little break here, it goes on top of old smoke. You have a little bit of rest there. Not too difficult there, that one for you. Okay, great. I'll see you next week. Bye.